Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if the Windows security settings are blank on your Windows 11 computer. I imagine this could definitely be a frustrating issue. And in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve it without too much of a hassle. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start off by opening up the search menu. Type in settings, best match, you come back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. Select apps on the left panel here. And on the right side, you want to go underneath apps and select installed apps. In the apps list field, you want to go ahead and search for security. Best match, come back to Windows security. Select the three dotted icon next to it and select advanced options. Scroll down underneath reset. If the app isn't working right, we can try to repair it. The app's data won't be affected. Select repair. And then attempt to see if the settings menu appears once again. If the app still isn't working right, you can try and reset it here. The app's data will be deleted. Select reset. This will permanently delete the app's data on this device, including your preferences and sign in details. Select reset. And once that's done, you have two check marks. Go ahead and close out of here. And I would suggest restarting your computer. Okay, so now that we're back in Windows, see if the problem has been resolved. If you are still having a problem, we can run a couple of scans using a command prompt window. So open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now I'm going to have two commands in the description of my video, guys. First one is a system file checker utility scan. So go ahead and copy that, and then go up to the top bar of the command prompt window, right-click on it, select edit, and paste that in. Hit enter to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so you can see Windows Resource Protection did find corrupt files and successfully repaired them. Now you want to go ahead and copy the second command in the description of my video, search of DISM, and then go up to the top bar of the command prompt window and paste it in just like you did with the first one.
Okay, so once that's done, go ahead and close out of here. And then you want to restart your computer. And once again, hopefully that was able to help resolve your problem, guys. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.